Fish Fish plays in the Syracuse Challenge, which starts Sunday, October 26th at Manlius Pebble Hills New Gymnasium. Tickets and season tickets and team gear are available now at SyracuseStallions.com. He's going to be signing autographs with his teammates up on the concourse from 645 to 745. He was a McDonald's All-American in 2012. He played at SU from 2012 to 2017. He just signed with the Syracuse Stallions, it's the new ABA team in town. He's 6'9", 260 pounds. Haley from Syracuse, New York. Let me hear it one time for the one. Next up, from the university, a former ESPN executive and uniquely qualified leader with a vast knowledge of and passion for Syracuse University and Syracuse University Athletics. He leads a 20 sports athletics department with more than 600 student athletes. The native of Buffalo, 1980, alumnus of Syracuse, that's I Newhouse School of Public Communications. Let me hear it one time for athletic director, John Wildhat. But not least, he's the only active FBS quarterback with 6,000 plus career passing yards and 1,000 plus rushing yards. He enters the season as the ACC active leader in QB rushing touchdowns, rushing yards, touchdown passes, and total offense. He is fourth in ACC conference history in career yards by a quarterback for total offense for a game behind only Lamar Jackson, Deshaun Watson, and Jameis Winston. As a student athlete, he is an accounting major, a two-time co-sida academic all-district selection, named to the 2016 all-academic football team, a four-time SU honor roll selection, and three-time member of the ACC honor roll. Ladies and gentlemen, let me hear it for the enter the 2018 Syracuse football season for quarterback Eric Dungey. Syracuse University, thank you Cheer Squad, thank you Otto, thank you Scooch, and most of all, thank you Syracuse Chiefs fans. Let me hear it one time. Are you on board with your Syracuse Chiefs? Let's cheer on your